Okay. We're all set here on the new outpost. Haha. -ha. Now, just the Heartlands is a lot easier than the regular mode. Hi. Hey, brings you around. gonna drink herself right into the grave. Ah, sure, take it. As long as she don't get into the moonshine business, I got the problem. <laughs> but honestly, I wouldn't get too attached to that old broad. She's on thin ice with my cousin. Uh. I'd personally like to keep this filling machine because it's a very useful mod. Air truck, big, tough, not slow as shit. Can't wait to upgrade in this world. Uh, instead of playing with some duplication going on, <laughs> this is how I played it last time and beat it. I had tons of stuff, so it was very easy to do. I have all the equipment at home that I need to do anything. I can make anything I want. Let's talk to so, her. Did you get my feeling machine? Oh shit! You need something? She's a tough old lady, but uh, she's not bad. All right, I need medical stuff and food, so that's actually the perfect building to go to. One thing I will say about this mode, it's, um, the, the map does need some fine tuning. There's a lot of stuff that you can just suddenly hit and you're stuck kind of thing. People find scavenging and whatnot very boring, but this game is for an outpost. This is the spot. kind of built around that. You know, you scavenge, you find stuff, find materials. You gotta find ammunition. The fact that I found it in a food place is kind of funny to me. <laughs> Alright. This is actually a pretty good find so far. That's a rucksack of meds. Which my community has been whining about not having any.
Oh yeah, if you fail to keep up with supply and demand, your people become very whiny. Oh wait, now I know a place where I can get materials. I know a place. There it is. I'm playing with my headphones down because it's just I find it better to not be wearing headphones. Hip it is. This is one of the two people you can pick to start off with, and she's a badass. <sighs> oh, I did find a game that I think okay. would make a very good playthrough. It's it seems really cool. I'm gonna try it out a little bit just to see if it is what I think it is because I watched the trailer on it and <sighs> yeah it just seems interesting I was wrong this place is going to give me food not material which is fine this place is going to give me guaranteed material so <coughs> Sorry about that. <sighs> yeah. Nah. Always a fun time playing this stuff. <clears throat> To recap that, I understand for some people, the scavenging is the most boring thing. They like the conversations. Okay, good for you. I'm not too much of a conversation guy. I prefer, you know, sneaking around, collecting stuff. I find that more intriguing. Hey, everybody's got their own thing. Is gonna catch up with me if I'm not careful. Yeah, I know your plague thing's a little high. Where's the last thing? Is on the roof. Not worth searching in here. I don't see any thing. Aha. <coughs> oh my. Sorry about the coughing. to lay off the Mary Jane.
This is some so one of the starting characters and so this is one of the two starting pair for this world. You can only pick one of two. And I think this is one of the more built around brutal playstyle. And what I mean by brutal is uh, you're much more into bashing skulls, being right up in their face and really just tearing things apart. While the other one, if you you know want to go unnoticed, sneaky, and just kind of cruise along, the other pair is better. More fuel per day is preferable. It's a nice rifle she gave us. Oh, fuck off. Okay. One, we're going to use that. Oh yeah, losing a character is not something you want to let happen. Because if you lose a character, they're going to have a skill that you're never going to get back. Because there's no, you know, extra replacement characters, it's all, you know, there's this character, and this character, and this character. Each one has their own specific skills and usages. Hell, a character that's fucking completely designed to be at base, but to unlock one for more useful things, you know, you gotta take her out to the field. Her fighting is only a couple stars. Her cardio is only a couple stars. Meaning, like, you can't go past a certain point. They, they, they don't have enough anything to go past that point. Which really freaking sucks. I'm gonna have to come down here with a cargo van. God damn it. And head back to base. Yeah, we seriously need supplies. Oof. I ain't get my truck upgraded. <laughs> yeah. Right at the start, I had, uh, I found this truck, a van, and I believe I found an air van fairly close by. No, I found an ambulance. <laughs> I like it when I find just every vehicle I prefer right nearby. Last time I played, I had to go halfway across the world. Okay. Materials, meds, food, fuel, materials, food. Ugh. 
almost a citizen or a hero. Okay. I'm gonna start heading down there. And I'm gonna take the cargo van. I don't know how much fuel it has. But it's got an empty trunk, so yeah. has gone off. <laughs> yeah. Get some materials back. I'm still taking home a lot more food than I need, so... Aha! Now when I initially was down in the area that I'm heading currently, I had a very intriguing system. I would take a vehicle, like a van here, and drive down there, but I wouldn't be driving through the city with this van because, you know, the van's bulky and difficult to maneuver through things. <clears throat> while other vehicles aren't um, vans. Come on. Aha. I know that was stupid, but what the hell could I do about it? Oh, buddy. was not what I expected. I expected to be able to stop and then wander on aimlessly. <laughs> I did not expect to be attacked. <laughs> Which is kind of weird considering I'm playing a zombie game. Haha, <laughs> good pancake. Try not to crash. It's always the goal is just to try not to crash. 
every time I step into a vehicle in a video game, that's the goal is to try not to crash. <laughs> kind of sad. I fail most of the time. Uh, and a few times that I don't, it's just, what the hell? Get the hell off my car. I don't want to deal with you. I don't even know what the hell that building is. Oh, that's a destroyed factory. That could actually have potentially good loot. Like, mods. Which is... really good. So, that's what I'm gonna have to do. So yeah, uh, what I'd pretty much do is... You know... I normally have an outpost. I uh, normally like turn one of these buildings into an outpost and then and use it like a little base of operations. But I prefer one that's actually in the city or in the the, the area. That'll run, I bet. Hmm. But there was actually a time where I did upgrade the vehicle. Well, looks that place. I'd say I just found another plague heart. <coughs> uh, excuse me. I upgraded the vehicle and brought it down here, and it was awesome. That's in our military truck. That should do it for now. It's in our freaking horde. No freaking horde. No freaking horde. So there's a mix of million up there. Hey neighbor, I got another proposition for you. Come on over when you can. See, she's not bad. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Oh. Okay, this is something I actually want to keep. I'm going to take this, you know, pretty damn far. I know I came in to do something, but, um... This is not a vehicle you just give up. Get off my ass. And that's why. You don't just give up a vehicle like this. This is the pretty much the anti-feral ride. Goodbye. This bitch can run forever. And <sighs> dum dum dum. Running, running, running. She is always running, cause yeah. I almost feel sorry for her. It just this is a constant thing with this character. I just seem to just make her run. And run. And run. I, oh you wanna stop and breathe? No, run. Oh you wanna scavenge the bullet? Nah, run. That is all I have her do. All the time. She's just running and running and running and running 
Running past so many things, running through areas, just just can't catch her. She just runs and runs and runs. You just cannot catch her. This also lets her spot a whole bunch of shit. Uh, the tower is going to give me a chance to take a look around. <coughs> spot every little thing. There's a little. There we go. That's the vehicle I'm going to take around. About a new check. Morning. We'll be at this game. I think you. Oh, I should. Nice. Hope you guys enjoyed this.